Next up on our Whammon Tour chat is someone a little near and dear to the Kiwi Farm's heart. Her name is Margaret Pless. Uh, she, in 2016, so this was a very long time ago, eight years ago, um, a, a little bit after Gamergate, the site had only been around for, what, like three years at this point. Um, she may, she had got a thread on the Kiwi Farms because Chimperger is one of the old school OPs that would do a lot of threads, a lot of good threads that are very enduring still. Uh, she was active on Twitter. Um, she was talking to people on Twitter. It says, never heard of this more until a few months ago, and I kept noticing her repeatedly pop up in YouTube comments of other locales I had been following closely. I had been given more information about her earlier today by those who have dealt with her directly, and she's trying to ask them the strangest and most invasive of questions. I tried to tell her that two of the people she keeps whining and complaining about are, uh, who were docs had already had their personal information here dropped here before anyone else decided to make it public, and you can see instances of all these things happen in these two threads. I tried to contact her and correct her and call her on her bullshit, but she blocked me. Um, and then people, then he goes through her contributions to the daily KOS and so on and so forth. Uh, and in response to this thread, which was published on January 4th, 2016, she published this in July, 2016 Kiwi farms, the biggest, the internet's biggest, uh, community of stalker. This was in the intelligencer, any article, about the kiwi farms including wikipedia will cite this article um she goes out and says uh basically tries to explain what the kiwi farms is uh for quite a while um calls it a virtual pillory uh a likens us to a website which is apparently about revenge porn and blackmailing uh, or H hands raid board. I would very much protest that this is an inaccurate, um, comparison, uh, but she goes on to say the largest virtual pillory and the one that best exemplifies its ethos is Kiwi farms, a loose community, a forum centered on a forum with two wikis, uh, activity on Tumblr, Twitter, steam, and local chan boards that specializes in harassing people they perceive as being mentally ill or sexually deviant in some way. That's also incorrect. Uh, the origins on the Kiwi Farms lies, as you expect, on 4chan, which is inaccurate, but she tries to say that because of Sonichu, that's where it comes from, and uh, grew out of the groups around Christian, which is accurate. The quickie explains that, that's pretty accurate. Um, they show up to Christian's real life court appearances, which is not really stalking, it's like a public event. Um, then they say that we're responsible for everything that's ever happened to Chris Chan and so on. This is the, the, uh, root ground zero for the Kiwi farms. This is uh, a website or an article that every single piece that says that we're a harassment stalking forum uses as its uh, baseline to derive from. And the real kicker is that the author, Margaret Pless, uh, who is Jewish, in case you're wondering, is a longtime user of the Kiwi Farms. She now goes by Stan. I, I don't know. I think she posted as Idolante at some point and then switched accounts when people started harassing her. But she's been active on the forum for at least since, I think, 2018, I want to say. Okay, 2021 is the origin of this account, but she's been active for years. Um, has thousands of posts. And has had at least two different accounts. I, I don't know why she gets out of this. <laughs> she, um, she, like, she's repeatedly, like, she uses the forum. She posts in her own thread. She posts in the Sweet Baby Inc. thread that she's going to dox people who are involved in um, the, the Sweet Baby Inc. Like, Gamergate 2.0 stuff. Is asking for leads on information about Gamergate 2 and shit. And she's like... Always in talk to staff complaining that people are posting pictures of her on her profile because apparently she's fat. Actually, I have the thread open. She's still active in this, I think. Is there a picture of her where she's fat? No. Well, there's another thread on this. 
Is it still going, or is this a response to me talking about her? No, this is... See, look, this is 18 minutes ago. She's still active in this shit. Uh, I'm doing it because the chimps did it first. I think it's silly and ridiculous. The whole conspiracy that the feminists and SJW deep state is coming to forcibly feminize the video games is just mind-blowingly silly to me. If you want, I can swap out Jews for lizard people, and the joke still works. The Gamergate white wing, right wing game policing is basically the purity test for video games. If you believe in freedom of expression, it follows that you need to be prepared. Others might say things that you don't like. It's just gay that everything is is like pause now, my dude. Six months ago, as I'm talking about her, she's posting still. I want to. There's a picture of her. I think it's everyone spams this on her profile, so it might just be the first thing I see if I go to her profile. No, right now it's just everyone angry about um, her threatening to dox people. She made this, by the way. She drew this in MS Paint. Please no Fed posting. We love our forms. And then there's like this badge. I don't know why she made this. I don't know what's a reference to. That's just a random woman. That's not her. Obviously. Okay, I might just Google it. Hold on. Nuts. Wait, is I, well, there's lots of Margaret Pluses, and I don't want to get like the wrong one. And uh, there's no picture of her on her um on her profile on the New Yorkers because uh, I don't want to like get it wrong. Sorry, give me a second. I'm Oh, if I click her her Twitter profile thing, it like incentivizes me to to follow her, and I don't want to do that. All right, I will leave it up to you guys to find this picture of her if you really are um, <laughs> if you're inclined, because I don't want to like pull up like a random picture of Margaret Pratt Bless. It's the first page, is it? Is that the picture where she's fat though? Because that's the one that they always spam at her. I don't think that's her. <laughs> that's what you're implying. Oh, also, these old threads by Chimp Burgers, they all use image tags, which means that they, they just go through, like, the image proxy, and that is extremely slow. So if you're wondering why these um, images take so long to load, it's because of that. No, it's not on the first page. Sorry, Chad, I failed you. Get it twisted. Reveal the score. I'm not revealing the score. He has a pot. <laughs> it's very hard to get a negative score on the forum, to be fair. Oh, well, I just wanted to point that out because I find it very amusing to me, me personally, on like an aside, that um, that uh, the first person to write a major article about the Kiwi Farms ended up using it because everyone knows, everyone knows that's a great site. They just one day they'll all accept it. How great it is! Okay, if someone wants to super chat me the fat picture, go for it. But Chimburgers neglected to post it on the um. So on the first page of her thread, but it's at the bottom. Okay, hold up. I'll, I'll, one more. This is my last attempt to salvage this. I should have pulled up a picture first. I don't. I never know because when I talk, I'm very ramblematic. So if I um, if I uh, go on a diatribe, I might want to show something that I didn't think about before, and then I don't have it on the ready. This guy is like, I think you're trolling me. This guy is like insistent. It's on the first page, you just have to scroll down. And I have scrolled all the way down. I just see no picture. Oh, wait. But she's not fat in this. I was, I was not looking for like a random picture of her at like her university. I want the one that everyone spams on her profile. Let me just check the, the first page again. Maybe it's there. No, it does not. Okay. I don't know. She looks very normal. That's, that doesn't prove my point. I can't make fun of somebody if they just look like a normal person. <laughs> Page three of her profile. You guys are just fucking with me now. Okay, I'm checking page three. I do see a picture. No, it's just a picture of a guy saying fat women aren't humans. Okay, this, okay, they're right. It was on number three. These are the pictures. They spam these pictures at her. These are pictures of her. And then she gets upset that people who know who she is, because it's very hard not to know who she is, are posting pictures of her on her profile. And it's like, well, what do you want me to do? 
You wrote an article about how we're a bunch of neo-Nazi far-right extremist conspiracy theorists, terrorists that only exist because we exist to pillory mentally handicapped people. And then you join the forum and use us. I don't know for what nefarious purpose, but you get some sort of enjoyment out of it. And then you ask me, like, if that counts as infighting. That doesn't really count as infighting. You're, you weren't like a forum user before. Um, you wrote an article about how we kill people or whatever the fuck. <laughs> Why... Why? Uh, well, I mean, honestly, I don't know what ex people expect me to do when um, she got set on page ten. <laughs> uh, all right, I'll leave it at that. This streamer is a mess, bro. You have no fucking idea. <laughs> yeah. I love that there's like a guy that has no idea who I am. I was like, this guy doesn't know what he's doing. This guy is sloppy and bad. <laughs> yeah, it's true. <laughs> That's accurate. Thank you for watching this clip by Colonel J. This is the King of Bold here. Remember to like and subscribe. Juice!